Welcome back to Space Weather News, your daily source for all things space weather related. If you enjoy our videos, please consider showing your support by subscribing to the channel. The sun has been buzzing with activity, captivating astronomers and space enthusiasts alike. In the past 24 hours, solar activity escalated to moderate levels, leaving us on the edge of our seats. One of the highlights was an impressive M1.4 flare that occurred at 041235 UTC, originating from the dynamic region 3354. But that's not all, this region also treated us to a C8 flare later on. The excitement didn't stop there, as region 3357 extended in length, even though its intermediate and trailing spots experienced decay. Region 3358 entertained us with its low-level C-class flares, but unfortunately, it too underwent decay. On the other hand, Region 3359 grew in size and rewarded us with captivating C-class activity. And although Region 3361 appeared rather unremarkable, it did make an appearance and was duly numbered. But that's not the only captivating event in the solar system. In C2 coronagraph imagery, a slow-moving coronal mass ejection emerged from the east-southeast limb at approximately 032136 UTC. Experts have modeled this mesmerizing phenomenon and believe it might have an Earth-directed component, possibly reaching us between late the 9th of July and the 10th of July. Looking ahead, we anticipate solar activity to continue at low levels until the 7th of July, with a likelihood of M-class flares and a slight chance of X-class flares until the 5th of July as our 3,354 moves out of sight. By the 6th of July, the probability of M-class flares decreases to a slight chance, but the intrigue remains. Shifting our focus to the energetic particles, the greater than 2 mega electron volts electron flux reached remarkable heights, promising an electrifying experience for space weather enthusiasts. Meanwhile, the greater than 10 mega electron volts proton flux remained at background levels, providing us with a sense of calm amid the solar storm. As we peer into the future, the greater than 2 mega electron volts electron flux is projected to reach high levels from 05 to the 7th of July, ensuring an electrifying ride for those who dare to venture into space. However, there is a slight chance of a greater than 10 mega electron volts proton event surpassing the S1- threshold on the 5th of July due to the flare potential of region 3354. But fear not, as background levels are expected thereafter once our 3354 ventures far beyond the western limb. Shifting our gaze to the solar wind, the past 24 hours showcased a solar wind environment reminiscent of an ambient-like state. The total magnetic field fluctuated between 5 and 7 nanotlers, while the BZ component remained neutral with no significant, sustained southward deflections. Solar wind speeds maintained an average range of 350 to 375 km per second, while Phi embraced a positive solar sector. As we cast our predictions for the coming days, we anticipate nominal conditions on the 6th of July however, brace yourselves for enhanced solar wind conditions on the 7th of July, all thanks to the anticipated arrival of the enthralling CME from the 4th of July. In terms of geospace, the geomagnetic field remained calm during the past 24 hours, providing a serene backdrop for celestial events. Looking ahead, we expect tranquility to persist until the 6th of July accompanied by a nominal solar wind. However, prepare for a magnetic storm of G1 intensity on the 7th of July as the 4th of July CME finally graces our planet, painting the skies with auroral beauty and captivating our hearts. Stay tuned for further updates on this cosmic drama as we unravel the mysteries of space and witness the enchanting dance between our Sun and Earth. Thank you for joining us in this thrilling journey through the wonders of space weather, but the adventure doesn't end here. Be sure to explore the captivating videos displayed on your screen, including our enthralling mini-documentary series that delves deeper into the mysteries of our universe. Don't forget to click on them, and while you're at it, show your support by liking and subscribing to our channel. Together, 
Let's continue to uncover the mesmerizing secrets of space. Thank you for watching.